so. We have to do something. Some say we can't do anything. Is it true? Of course not. Good morning. This is the Seiju Hall here in Setagaya. And this is where the Setagaya speech contest for this year is being held. The second lesson is the importance of friends. Soccer is a team sport. We must trust our teammates so that we can pass the ball to each other constantly and score a goal. Soccer taught me that a true team player is someone who can cooperate with teammates to get the best results. Making myself better, making my teammates better, and making the game better. So we are about to witness how English education is being done here in Japan. And one of the main activities here in Setagaya is to hold an annual speech contest among the students. So we'll be witnessing that later on. I believe that they will come when people's stomachs along the world are filled with happiness. I believe that they will come when what you think now will be the driving force to move the world in the future. I believe the day you reach out to someone we will be the day you change the world. I believe. This is the lineup for the 30th English Speech Contest here in Setagaya for the junior high school. Well, now it's 11.20, so we already missed the speech contest for the recitation for the first graders. And the speech contest for returnees is currently ongoing, so we missed out on that. So, so good night. <laughs> 自分のタイプ、使命、学校名などのアナウンスが終わったらスピーチを始めてください。So we'll just, I'm just gonna get inside for the third part of the program, which is the speech contest for third graders and second graders, which will start at 12:20 in the afternoon. So might as well have lunch first before getting inside. people around the world should deepen their understanding of each other. Doing so will give us a chance to communicate better. This is because there are differences in the way Japanese and Westernized think. For example, take the image of the mask. In Japan, many people wear masks to prevent cold, a fever, and so on. Wearing a mask promotes a healthy image. But that image is the opposite in the West. These days, English is required for primary school education, and there is easy access to English. I think that many people should be able to speak to foreigners. So I wonder why Japanese people can't speak English. There are two reasons. First, it's a Japanese character. When I went abroad, people spoke outgoingly. If you ask people for directions or if you speak English correctly, they will gladly help. In Japan, very few people do that. One of the factors, I think is that Japanese people are shy. The style of Showa and that of Heisei Edo Kiriko are completely different in designs, colors, and other features. They change with the time. So, I wonder what is traditional Edo Kiriko. My father said it is to surprise and captivate people by cutting glass. It's the essence of Edo Kiriko. To continue this way is traditional. He needs to feel the signs of the times if he wants people to be surprised and captivated. The customers have always wanted that. So he needs to observe something good and what is needed and omit what isn't necessary with color. OAO is important for him. 
Making these decisions properly each time is a small innovation. Today's craftsmen have to study what the ancestors did and try to do something new. Observe, add, and omit. Food loss in Japan and the world. In Japan, about 6 million pounds of food are thrown away in a year. We import a lot of food, but at the same time, we cast them off. Yes, that's plastic. We always use it in our daily lives as plastic bags, plastic borders, packaging containers, and so on. It is cheap, light, but strong, and so useful for us. But I can get any information quickly and easily. Nowadays, smartphone seems to be an indispensable tool for communication with friends. Most of my classmates have their own smartphone, but I don't have my own smartphone, nor my personal SNS account neither. Without SNS, what am I doing at home? The world is becoming globalized and Japanese companies becoming globalized too. To accept Workers from other countries will be useful for overseas. The people who wrongs them never change your opinion. But accepting ourselves, we can build our own confidence and change how we feel. I learned this from this experience and this song. Around the world, there are many different people like me. I think they should focus on their strengths, not on their weaknesses. Because I too focus on my strengths. I hope many people can have confidence, overcome many obstacles, and change themselves. I believe breaking the barrier has the power to change our lives. Now, I not only study English, I decided to study math too. It's more difficult to pass them in math, but I will do it. Because I know if I do it, I can develop not only my academic ability, but my spirit as well. There are many cultures around the world that may be different from the cultures that we grew up with. So, it is important for us to understand and respect other cultures. Second, we should not believe all the information we get. In accordance with current innovations, it is easy for us to get the information via the internet or news. However, it is not always 100% accurate. Third, we should take opportunities to tell people about our own country. Winners, please come up the speech after everyone is announced. The eighth prize winner is Have our own confidence by Murata Niho from Yoga Junior High School. The seventh prize winner is What Saka Taught Me by Nakamoto Masaki from Kamisoshi Aya Junior High School. Winner is Failure is the high road to success by Tanaka Anna from Kinitaki High School. The fifth prize winner is Breaking the Barrier by Kojima Nanami from Oksawa High School. Fourth prize winner is Animal Therapy by Kiura Kori from Boca High School. The third prize winner is Japanese Mystery by Song Iena from Kiura The second prize winner is 
up our own confidence. Sorry, from little effort, from to a big chance. By Yoshinari Leona from Yoga Junior High School. First prize winner is food loss and global warming from our classroom by Johansson Ilman from Yahata Junior High School. Congratulations, so Mina, please come up the stage. She should be. She should belong to the top 50%. Top <laughs> oh, 30%. Top 30%. Yeah. She's good. <laughs> Everybody is busy taking pictures. <laughs> 